hey, what's up? Uh, what's going on? I'm still out here sounding alarms. I'm trying to get um, what do you, do you call this thing? These videos are under one minute. Day. Uh, hey, YouTube, and it's short. It's Kenya. I don't even know why I'm still working for YouTube. Yo, like my YouTube channels are dead. Did I, I already mentioned that in like the previous videos. This happy list that you like, like it's frozen. It's looking like a dead man. Oh, yeah. I just remembered a dream that I had of a a cousin of mine that's very heavy into uh, sorcery. I woke up around. And this cousin was busy driving a vehicle full of people. Essentially, God is showing me that witches are charting the destinies and the courses of people across the show. And this thing has gotten intense and extreme. Yes, you don't last night, guys. I am in the middle of a very purified fast. Like, I'm repent of just about anything and everything. I am fasting rapidly. I evangelist Fernando Perez on the internet. So, I am fasting rapidly. 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 I am fasting I am literally at the height of purity right now. Full of repentance, and yet I keep on getting visited by a, a, a dark entity that literally causes me to have sex in a dream. Like deliverance ministers need to change their doctrine in saying that you have to be seasonally compromised or doing something strange in order for these things to visit you. You need to change your doctrine. These things are attacking Christians despite a season of exquisite purity. I also got like this dream last night where. Uh, I've got furniture in storage. These people were trying to steal my chairs and whatnot, my uh, lounge suite, um, alongside my dining room suite. But they couldn't steal you on a line, line, dining room suite. Also, what did they do? They tore the back. It was the, the leather chairs. They tore the back of my uh, dining room. The, one of the chairs, Banka. You know how it is that they cause they cause it to be all cushed up, gasp on to that fluff, that white fluff that you find inside cushions and couches and whatnot. They stole that. They took that, and then as they were leaving, and they put it in like in the back of some what I understood to be a freezer truck. You know these trucks that carry meat. It was a refrigerator truck that they put behind there. You know how during COVID nineteen, due to the uh, uh, um copious amounts how overflowing mortuaries were they would p put people in these freezer trucks they carrying meat just to preserve emis in Bayabo. they put my fluff of my like furniture in that freezer truck almost as if though it's dead like dead deeds and my furniture has been stolen from me officially and after as, as they were leaving in the back of this freezer truck all right um van as it was driving off i heard one of them say next time ronkas to look out fail this time we couldn't take all of the chair we were only able to take the fluff so basically we were taking little by little little by little eating away at my furniture just one shoe here and uh, sorry one a uh, teaspoon here, one that they haven't been able to take yonk everything from me. Mara, they intend to little like bite-sized thefts. So they tore it, took the sponge, put it in the freezer truck, and they were in the freezer in and of themselves. Uh, they're representing that they're dead people already. They're in some kind of a mortuary state, and they drove off. And the truck drove off. And as they were drove, driving off, I overheard the one saying, "Next time, Romun kelas to logo fella." So they, there was a plan to steal like wholeheartedly why did they struggle to steal from me i'm a christian i'm a believer guys i get let's get tapelo so um my stuff is hedged in a piece of my hair a lock of my hair but they can't take my entire glory they can't take all of my hair they take things that really i can fix it i can fix it they haven't prospered to take more than that and this is something that was happening what i understood to be very very ubiquitously mind you this whole thing uh, it was happening inside Woolworths. Campus Square. And they were leaving in a freezer truck. God is showing me they are stealing not only destinies, but they're stealing wealth of entire organizations. They are stealing um uh well, what do you call this uh, uh destinies like uh, positions like uh, jobs in a local corporate it was a, a mall man it was a mix of campus square LA, Yako, sorry when was Yako, campus square alongside um garage my uncle where my furniture was at alongside some uh f like it, it looked like um uh, a little bit of a fruit and veg, a uh, food lovers market store where you know, health stuff, you know, like spirulina. It was literally a combination of Willie's, my, my my uncle's garage where my furniture is at, this food lovers looking like store, and oh, and a, a palazzo, like not palazzo king, so like a, 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 a shoe store. It's like just a, a commerce industry trade. 
just a combination of commerce industry and, and trade where there is a co there's a, a bunch of people by Uzwang. They just steal jobs, careers, futures, the economy of the world. And that, that situation occurred, I guess, in my country, South Africa, but it's about to be decimated. And Untwe Kalang is Shube Kalang Kreshap no. Kari Festa November, guys. And Mudimun Pons says something like Christmas. Kars Fierce. Something about December, and in particular, the date that is Christmas. There is something prolific about Christmas. I don't know if it's Christmas season or Christmas. Christmas. Something's happening. I don't know what it is. The piece of the puzzle is not coming together. I'm seeing dimly as to a mirror, as it is written in 1 Corinthians 13. But I'm just going to send out the warnings despite seeing dimly. And whatever it is, it's nefarious. And in the absence of prayer, and God is going to rain wrath on the earth. So if my people who are called by my name will get down on their knees and pray and seek me for solace. Okay, fine. So I'm paraphrasing. I will turn my wrath from them and I will heal their land. Whatever that is about to come. They are dropping like dominoes. It goes after David. I don't even know what it feels like. Guys. I can't even imagine the wicked at Tambanaga thing. It would talk on trainer. I was mourning. They block it. I was crying when when they were covering footage earlier. Yeah, but I'm like, those, those, those kids in South Korea that passed away. I could not stop sobbing. It's like I find encouragement because I'm edified as a Christian in and of myself within my own personal capacity. To find through a day, I always get taken back to square one just by opening the internet. And there's no running away from it. I, I tried the other day to say, wait again, I don't want to see these things. I'm just going to hide. I'm just going to hide myself from news. But what in the world? Am I supposed to like live like a hermit and not share what's going on? It is what it is. I'm in a world full of sorrow. And it's written in Ecclesiastes that it is better to be in a house full of mourning than one full of joy. Because in the house of mourning, repentance, guys. That is metanoia. People repent and they turn to their hearts to God. So, so, Kelly, I'm beseeching you. Kelly, go by. I don't have Otherwise, now that I'm in the guys, I'm a child of God, I'm covered. Like, right? So, what, what I'm doing right now is petitioning for you. I'm literally pleading for those of you basing 100% serious. So, you know, be sure. I'm beseeching you. Or live a serious. Because if you can't stink in the air, if you can't pick up the stench of something, a body ling, more, 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 guys, what's going on, Kalun? Kilor lega kazanya ka eche sin kasata ne kabulu e hard noko. At hoka fezi, lele me litu lega side thingi like you know how people die and their tongues are like on the side like that. At hoka fezi maramu tateng na drava kolui. God is showing more about loi, but control the fat. Not drava kolui enang ne batu kamuhar. But loi, but what hoka fezi dead, dead, do it, do it. Gone. They might as well be in eternity burning in the lake of fire. Go peli lenga bo reprobates. Abatanduk tagata are running the world. They are about to take the wheel. And in the absence of uktanda asas, your tatuatina and God is gonna finish them off. Diaboniswa guys. Nyanyanga. Pray if you don't wanna. Yo. Okay. Like uh, pray for yourself so you can make the rapture. Something is going down. Go intense. If you are a TikToker or a Tonga City dance video, these videos, these videos, like focus on what's important. That's what I'm trying to explain to you. Even a video of a cute baby cooing and gagaring and goo there is no time for that. Look at the world, look at the news, and look inside yourself. Gauge if you are saved. If you are, pray, contribute to the redemption of the earth. If you don't, go pelile. Kushubile Santing is up, and I don't know he ni. I am seeing murkily as through. See, Billy said, Murd, muddy. Marawana lento, eh, go some gahampa, guys, go nento, eh, bolai, eh, bilayo, and yanuga, it's nefarious. We need to rabelai, and I'll begin it then. I, I can show. I can, I, 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 I